And our cross piece is 0, 05. And all of the holes in here will match nicely with the holes in each of the bottom parts of our 2201s. And I'll click over this in place. And there we have essentially the bulkhead number one. With our box on top, the hinge goes forward and that goes for our right side then and our left side. And we're just about ready now to place this in place on the fuselage side. We have just a little preparation first. We can trial fit our first bulkhead to the right side of our skin. Now here's the top and the bottom and here's the front lip with pre-drilled holes and I'm holding our bulkhead. Here's the top, here's the right side, here's our hinge up front and the holes along this flange here match up very nicely with this flange. So we're simply going to lay it down in place and match the holes up. And remember our spacer is in here. Note that the holes should line up all the way into the top of the box. Note again the three rivets that need to be pulled first when we go to rivet because this part would be in the way if we waited too long. So we need to up drill to the final rivet size where all the holes line up. And then eventually we'll get the other half of the fuselage in place as it, as it will work out the same way as far as the rivet connections. Now we have a few more pieces to insert. This is number 06 splice plate that will go on the inside and notice these holes here will line up here. I'll just slide this in and we'll clico this in place. And then 07 splice plate will slide in from the front. And sit like that. Now we will note that the holes underneath here will catch the holes and the holes here should align also. We can look at this from the other angles also. Here's looking from the other direction 